and welcome here to Talk FCB and welcome back to the channel here today guys where I want to talk to you about Chabi Alonso because he has been very strongly linked with Barca this morning and there's lots of rumours going around lots of excitement potentially about the prospect of getting him because look he's doing a wonderful job at Bayer Leverkusen right there he is five points clear at the top of the Bundesliga nobody saw that coming what they did against Bayern on the weekend by the way was extraordinary a three 3-0 victory there for Alonso's team. I think the football that he's playing, it's incredible. Would I like to see that style of play come to Barca? Of course I would. Of course we would all love that. But is it going to be a reality? I mean, really, because what we're hearing in the media right now is that plenty of people inside of the club dream about Alonso. But I mean, is that the point? Are we dreaming really about something that we can't actually have? Apparently, the club admires his style. They've really enjoyed what he's been doing at Leverkusen. And it's also been noted there that Xabi Alonso's father actually played for Barcelona during his professional career. And as a result of that, Xabi Alonso himself actually spent a number of years in his childhood in the city of Barcelona, whether that has any impact at all. But the other thing that is being reported too, not only about Alonso's quality there, that's not only the reason why Barca would be looking at him, but reports there say that it's also the fact here that by getting him, it would be a big blow to Real Madrid. Because of course Alonso is a former Real player, he's strongly linked there with their club and they believe there that by bringing Alonso to Barca, that would really hurt Madrid. And I just want to say, and I just want to make it very, very clear here, we should never, ever pick a coach, pick a player, simply with the thinking of, that's going to hurt Real Madrid. I don't care about that. None of us should. Of course, there's a rivalry there. Of course, we want to push ourselves. We want to be better than Real Madrid. But that means being our best selves. That means actually focusing on what's best for us, best for Barca, not thinking about what's going to hurt them, what's really going to be the decision that angers them in making our own choices. And I just want to say here and now, I don't really think Alonso is a genuine Barca target anyway. I think not even thinking about Real Madrid, but he's most likely to go to Liverpool, another one of his former clubs there. They're, of course, losing Jurgen Klopp. They're looking for the head of their brand new project. And, of course, Alonso very much fits the bill. So, certainly, we'd like to see him at Barca. His style of play here, I think, would work out very, very well. And it would be a blow to Real Madrid. But that's not the point at all right now. And I'm not really sure that we should be getting too excited about him, that we should be reading too much into these reports. And there's going to be a full video, guys, coming up on the channel very, very soon. I'm working on it now, where we talk about what the new coach needs, where we talk about what Barca needs in this very moment. Keep an eye out for that. I will see you soon. But until next time, yeah, as always, Vizca, yeah, Barca. Uh -huh.